Okay. Hello, Hello teacher Chancellor. Hello. You are late. Yeah. Okay. How are you today? I'm fine. And you? I'm good. I'm good. And I'm a little bit tired today, but I'm great. I'm okay. <laughs> Okay, yes. and how's your day been? It's so funny because uh, my my subject is English. Mm -hmm. I have to do uh, a group, a group a to group? do a conversation. Yeah. Okay, and what do you need to do in this group? I have to do draw. Okay, draw like a, and, a drawing competition yeah. or not a competition? I drawing a sticker, sticker and we are talking about uh, my favorite city. Okay, nice. And this is for your class in English? Yes, it's so funny. Oh, nice. Okay, interesting. And how's that going? Is it going good? Yes, of course. But uh, <laughs> I, the time is going so quick. Oh. And my group is a little bit late. Okay. Because, uh, because my mem one member is in my group is leave. Yeah. Oh, oh no. So where did they leave? Do they not want to be part of the group? No, because uh, she was sick. Okay, I see. Wow. So how many are you in this group? Uh, the, the group is have to uh, have a uh, Four people, four members. Okay, four people, four members. Nice. Okay. It's yeah. And my crew is only three, three people. Ah, now it's only three people. Yes. And <laughs> so you it's say, so... Mm -hmm. it's so tired to do because uh, my crew is leave one member. And um, I wanted to ask you, what, what is the topic about? The topic about the my favorite city. Favorite city. Okay. And what is your favorite city? Oh, my favorite city is Ho Chi Minh City. Oh, right. How do I say it? Ho? Ho Chi Minh. Ho Chi Minh City. Okay, is that in Vietnam? Yes, it is in mm. Vietnam. Oh, nice. Why is that your favorite city? Because I love, I love the food the most. <laughs> because ah. the food here is so. I love the street food. <laughs> okay, the food is great. Oh, interesting. Yeah, it's so difficult. Uh, Delicious and tasty. Nice. Okay, what else is good about this city? Uh, I think I like people. Also, I also like the people here. Okay, wow, nice. Yeah, the people in Ho Chi Minh City is so friendly and helpful. Oh, that's very good. So that's so cool. Like, I like it when you go to cities. And the people are friendly and nice to talk to. Yes, I can ask them in the street. Okay, so you can ask them. What can you ask them? I asked. Uh, <laughs> I asked the uh, how to how to get to the supermarket or how to get to the uh pet shop or many places in Ho Chi Minh so <laughs> okay what language many do things. they speak there yeah 
What language do they speak there? Uh, they, they speak Vietnamese. Vietnamese. Yeah. Oh, okay, Vietnamese. Some some people, some people in America or Australia go to Ho Chi Minh City, and I met them. <laughs> ah, interesting. And what did you think about them? Oh, they are they are so friendly, and I want to talk to them and. I talk with the I oh, like very this good. conversation. Yeah. Nice, nice. And okay. my mother is so proud of me. <laughs> oh, excellent. Yeah. Speaking to foreigners can sometimes be amazing. It can sometimes be very fun actually. Yeah, <laughs> I love this conversation because this is the first time. <laughs> oh, that's very good. Yeah, confidence is everything. Very nice. Okay, yeah. wow. So, I am leaving at the end of this month. Oh, leaving? Yes, yes. You living to somewhere? Yes, I'm. I've got other work, so I'm going to take up some new work. And oh, where do you go? Oh, so I'm going to be working. I'm still going to be working here, but just for another company. Yeah. So okay. I'm very. I'm very sad about this month. Yeah. But. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> so I really hope Ellie will give you a great, another great teacher. And yes, okay. I hope that. Yeah, hopefully we can enjoy our last times together and just have some fun. Um, yeah, so that's it's the sad news. Um, yeah, I'm so sad to hear that. I know, but the good news is we have a few classes together before I leave. We actually have lots of classes before I go. So don't worry too much. And yeah, okay. Yeah, so that's happening. What else is news? Uh, I... I see my e English teacher have a baby. <laughs> oh, okay. No she English. has a lovely baby. Oh, does she live in Vietnam? Yes. Oh, uh, okay. She works in my school. Wow, she works at your school. Is she a foreigner or is she Vietnamese? She is Vietnamese and my English teacher is foreigner. He's He's from Australia. Okay, so you have a tea wait, wait, your English teacher is from Australia? Yeah. Yes, and one English teacher is from Vietnamese. Okay, so you have two teachers at the school that are teaching English. Yes. Wow, okay. That's very good that you've got an Australian English teacher. Um, yeah. Their accent is sometimes like difficult to understand, so that's really good that you get used to it as well. Yes, I think uh, the pronouns in Australia is yeah more difficult than the pronouns is um, pronunciation. Yeah. Can you say that? Of Pronunciation. Pronunciation. Yeah. I think uh, I hear the pronunciation of England. I understand it, but uh, the pronunciation of Australia, I don't, I don't, oh. I don't uh, understand all. Yeah, it's actually the same. It's not very different, but there are small differences, but what gets a person is the accent, so how they sound. 
that that's yeah. quite different so it's great if you can get used to how people in america sound how people in the us yeah usa england um, australia new zealand because everybody sounds different yes of course Scotland and ireland i have yeah i have a little bit difficult to <laughs> understand Ah, oh, you'll get better. You just need to keep working at it, keep practicing. Yeah. Okay, so we are busy with Unit 6, Our Planet. Are you ready? Yes, already. All right, so lesson two, conservation. What is conservation? Conservation is... Oh, oh no, we had this last week. Yes. Is us uh, keep safe. Keep safe something. Mm -mm. Oh, the conservation. Mm -hmm. Remember, I meant. I told you what it means on Friday. Friday we had it. Yes. Okay. Mm. Okay, so what is it? It's it's the work we do, right? To to save nature, to protect nature, to protect nature, right? The steps we take to protect nature. So conservation is how we can help the environment, how we can help the earth. All right. Yes. All right. okay. Let's go to our vocabulary. We can help environment. In my Are you ready? Not yet? Yes. Okay. I go to try to write it. Oh, make notes. Very good. Okay. So, vocabulary. So, how can we protect the earth, basically? Conservation. Okay. We can. Take public transportation. Take bu public transportation. Right, because then there will be, if we if there's less cars on the road, we will let go of less carbon dioxide from the vehicles. So it's better to, if we can just take a big bus and not 10 cars, for example, right? Yes. Take reusable shopping bags. Take reusable shopping bags. Use energy. Use energy, Use energy saving like bulbs. Like bulbs. Like bulbs. Okay. Like bulbs. Bulbs. Yes, Use good. Okay, like so those. if we have these energy saving light bulbs, we are adding to helping to save energy, right? Energy yes. requires a resource that we need to protect. Yeah, energy is so important. In, Very good. Yeah, so we just can't use of all of it. Bulbs. So, yeah. Keep the air conditioner on low. Yeah, so keep the air conditioner on low. So let it, just make sure that you don't put it too high so that it won't use too much electricity, right? Yes. Good. Grow your own vegetables. Grow your own vegetables. Yes, this is something I really want to do. 
I really want to start a vegetable garden and try grow my own vegetables, but I can never yeah. find time. I can never find the time to get to do it. Yeah, me too, but I have a little bit free time. Mm, yeah, okay, good. Do you have a garden? Hmm? Do you have a garden? I have a garden, um, but I don't have any vegetables. Yeah. What so do you it's plant? just grass and um, plants, but not, not any like fruits or vegetables. But I would like to start with some fruits and vegetables, you know? Yeah, I um, understand. Yeah, so hopefully maybe this month or next month i can maybe start with getting some things together to start a nice vegetable yeah. garden <laughs> um okay dry your clothes outside dry your clothes outside okay i do this i, I like to do this but if the weather is bad um when in winter we can't dry our clothes outside the clothes would just like freeze Yes, of uh, course. So I have like a, a rack inside and I, I hang my clothes up inside. Um, yes. I try not to use the dryer because it uses electricity. But if I really need to use the dryer, I will. Uh, yeah. Because I need to wear, wear clothes. But yeah, so if the weather is good, I dry my clothes outside always. And what about you? Uh, and I, I and my mother usually dry my dry our clothes inside. Okay, so my mother and I. Yeah. Correct that grammar. Okay, my mother and. I use usually try hang up the clothes inside to try. Yeah. Okay, clothes. good. So my mother and I usually hang up the clothes inside to dry. So we hang them up inside. Okay, same as me. Good. Yeah. Okay, nice. All right, so we take public transportation. So if we take public transportation, we'll conserve energy, right? So won't need as much gas and we won't pollute, all right, into the air. We won't cause as much pollution. Yeah. Okay, so 10 people can take the bus and 10 cars don't need to be on the roads. So then there's a lot, a lot less um, energy needed and a lot less um, fumes put in the air, right? Yes. Okay, good. Okay, can you read for us? Okay. Number one, take public transportation. Public. Number two, public, 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 public. Okay. Number two, take reusable shopping bags. Reusable. Reusable shopping bags. Three, use energy saving light bulbs. Four, keep the air conditioner on low. Good. Five, grow your own vegetables. Six, dry your clothes outside. Good work. Beautiful. Very nice work. All Thank right. You. Good. Okay. That's why I'm so strict on you to be careful for grammar or pronunciation because I know you will work on it. Good work. Yeah. All, all right. right. So let's have a look. Okay, here we can see three pictures. Let's listen and practice. Okay, let me just... There we go. Page 54. B. 
Can you hear? Listen and say. Yes. Then practice. Okay, good. If we take public transportation, we'll conserve energy. One. If we take public transportation, we'll conserve energy. Two. If we take reusable shopping bags, we'll conserve energy. Three. If we use energy-saving light bulbs, we'll conserve energy. Four. If we keep the air conditioner on low, we'll conserve energy. Five. If we grow our own vegetables, we'll conserve energy. <sighs> Six. If we dry our clothes outside, we'll conserve energy. Okay. Yeah. Um, wait, let's go back. Okay. Okay, so number one, if we take public transportation, we'll conserve energy. What is happening in number two? Number two is... Page 15 and say... We'll conserve okay, energy. I hit... I hit one. If we take public transportation usable shopping bags, we'll conserve energy. I can hear that. Yeah? I can uh, hear. If we take reuse use reusable, reusable shopping bags, we'll conserve energy. Good job. So if we use reusable shopping bags, we'll conserve energy. Good, okay. Um, because we can reuse them the whole time. Good. Yeah. Number four? Number four is if we use energy saving light bulbs. No, number we'll four. Oh, number four. Okay. If we keep the air conditioner on low, we'll conserve energy. Good job. Number six? Number six, if we dry your clothes outside, we'll conserve energy. Good job. If you dry your clothes outside, we'll, okay. if we dry our clothes outside, we will conserve energy. Nice. Good. Let's listen. Yes. Page 55. See, listen, and say. Then practice. He'll conserve energy if he takes public transportation. One. He'll conserve energy if he takes public transportation. Two. She'll conserve energy if she keeps the air conditioner on low. Three. He'll conserve energy if he takes reusable shopping bags. Four. She'll conserve energy if she uses energy-saving light bulbs. Five. He'll conserve energy if he dries his clothes outside. Six. She'll conserve energy if she grows her own vegetables. All righty. Yes. Number one. Number one, he'll conserve energy if he takes public transportation. Good job. Number four? Number four, she'll conserve energy if she uses energy saving light bulbs. Uses. Uses. Oh, okay. Okay, so remember to say uses. She'll conserve energy if she uses energy saving light bulbs. Okay, because oh. she's probably, you don't use a light bulb once, you use it more than once. So we say uses. Yes. Got that? Okay. Good. Next number. Number six, six is. 
She'll conserve energy if she crawl your or uh, huh? she crawl grammar. She crawls her or vegetables. Okay, say that again. The grammar was all over the show. She'll conserve energy if she crawls her own vegetables. Beautiful, much better. Good work. Yes. <laughs> I have a little bit worried. <laughs> <laughs> no, good. All right, let's go, let's go. Listen. Oh. Okay, and read. Okay, so let's read because I think our reading skills are good enough. Okay, yes. so I will be the reporter. You are going to be Dr. Ma McMahon. McMahon? Yeah, so you're going to read this for me. Okay. Okay, so this is your part. Okay. All right, let's go. McMahon. What do you, okay, so sorry, an interview with Dr. McMahon. What do you do, Mr. McMahon? I'm an environmental scientist. My job is to find ways to conserve energy at school, at home, and at work. What can we do to conserve energy? If you plant a garden and grow your own vegetables, you can. Uh, conserve energy. You can also recycle bottles and cans after you use them. What about conserving electricity? If you use energy saving light bulbs and turn off the lights when you leave a room, you conserve electricity. You also conserve energy if you take a bus, a train, or a subway. Remember, you don't have to drive your car, everyone. Remember, you don't have to drive your car, you everyone. You don't have to drive your car, everyone, okay? Thank you, Mr. McMahon. You're welcome. Very nice. Oh, nice reading piece, okay? Reading something about an environmental environmental scientist. Wow. So what's uh, Dr. McMahon's job? She's an environmental scientist. She's? Oh, he's. He's. I think he's. Yes. Oh. He's. He's. Okay, he's an environmental. His. Oh. oh. That one. Okay. He's. Okay, and what does she? Oh, what does she say can conserve energy? Oh, it's saying a she. Okay, no, you were right. It yeah. sounds like a guy, though. Okay, so what does she say can conserve energy? What can conserve energy? Oh, uh, she say people can grow their own vegetables and recycle bottles and cans to conserve energy. Okay, good. And what else? How can we conserve electricity? Uh, she say people can use energy saving bulbs, turn off the lights when they leave a room and use public transportation to save electricity. Good job. Okay, nice. Good work. Well done. Any questions? No, I don't have any questions. Okay, 
Use a common a comma to separate the clauses when the sentence begins with if. If you ride your bike, you will conserve energy. Where can we put the comma? The comma will in this. Good work. Okay. Yes. Okay, so if you ride your bike, you will conserve energy. Nice. So easy. Number two, if people recycle more, the earth will be cleaner. Okay. Recycle more, the earth. There. If your family plants a garden, you will have vegetables and conserve energy. Okay. Very good. Nice. You can hear where that comma needs to be. Good work. Very nice. Yes. Excellent. So it was really easy peasy, hey? Yes. A plus. Good work. Nice. A plus. Okay, yeah, so how well, can they you. conserve energy? How can we conserve energy? Oh, they conserve energy. Free talk. You need to know, how can we conserve energy? We can conserve energy by? By use energies. Saving light bulbs. Yes. Okay, we remember to speak in a nice full sentence. We can conserve conserve energy by using energy saving light bulbs. And what else? What else? And uh we can we can reuse the reusable shopping bag. Good job. Okay, so we can conserve energy by using light saving energy bulbs and using yes. reusable shopping bags. What else? And take public transportation. Oh, we I can remember. conserve energy by taking public transportation. Remember, I said to you sentences answering with nice full sentences is very important okay uh they they can also dry our clothes outside yes good job we can dry our clothes outside to conserve energy uh what else can we do come on we had so many we can plant some vegetables Yes, we can and have keep the air. Bomb. They also can keep the air of uh, keep the air conditioner on low. Yeah, keep the air conditioner on low. Good work to conserve energy. And yes. and uh, they can grow your own vet. Uh, I said they that can what? grow our. Okay. We, we can grow our own vegetable garden to conserve energy. Or we can say they can grow a vegetable garden to conserve energy. Use your grammar correctly. Okay. Your sentences. <laughs> Just need to work on that. Yes. After the lesson, I will have another lesson. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I'm so work. tired. <laughs> no problem. Relax. It's okay. Okay. What does the word public mean? Let's match. Public. Okay. I can. Air conditioner. Shopping. Good. The activity of buying things, good. Air conditioner, a machine that keeps the air in the building cool, good. Like that. Good. Okay. 
Good I'm work. Dead. Nice, 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 nice. Easy peasy. Yes. <laughs> yeah, easy peasy. Good work. Write the missing words. Okay. If if you if you want if you want to, to help the environment environment we you can you will shut off the water shut off the water right if you're not using the tap turn the water off shut down the water number yes. two if you want to help the environment seems like if you're starting you want that. to help the okay the environment what can you do i can throw my old vegetables. Good job. Okay, so I can plant a garden. Plant okay, we don't garden. know what he's planting. Okay, maybe it's vegetables, maybe it's fruit. So we can just say, I can plant a garden. Nice. Number three. Can she do what? What can she do if she wants? No. Yes. <laughs> she she wants no. to the environment. <laughs> okay. She use, uses energy saving light bulbs. Okay, she okay, so she uses energy saving light bulbs. Good. Use energy saving light bulbs. Good. Okay, next. Okay. Uh if we take if public, we take public transportation transportation will conserve energy good she'll, she'll conserve she'll energy conserve energy if she keep the air conditioner on low no if she, energy if she turn up the light okay yeah uh, but this is confusing because i do see the temperature here yeah so it is confusing confusing okay, okay. next if we if we dry if we dry our clothes outside will conserve energy Good work. So if we dry, dry our clothes outside, we'll conserve energy. Nice. Good work. Homework. Okay, yes. so I'll send you the homework. Well done today. Did you like the lesson? Yes, I love this lesson. And uh, uh, you live you leave the the item or you leave sorry uh, no 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 what do you mean <laughs> no <laughs> say again uh what do you leave what do i live yeah huh? where do i what live do I yeah, where do you live in? Where where do you live? Okay. Why are you using poor grammar today? Huh? Yeah. What's I, happening? Uh, uh, I want to ask uh, you, where do you live? I'm in America. Okay. Yeah. I see. <laughs> okay, so I'm over here at the moment, and I know you yes. are in Vietnam, but all right, so I hope you can do your homework, and I will see you next time.
Yes, okay. Okay, bye-bye. See you next bye -bye. time. Bye-bye. See you bye. on Friday. Yes, bye-bye.